Hey guys, Herf here. Welcome to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Uh, well, the day is upon us. Today is the day that we've been working for for most of the series. Um, we are going to go fight the Overseer and attempt to ascend uh, at the Alpha level off the island. So, let me, you know what? Let me grab... Sorry, I, I've got a couple of last things to grab here. I made up about 20 more bullets with just what we had here on hand. And I did go over to Genesis and grab... I grabbed a few soups. We got Freya Curry. Uh, I think... Is that Lazarus Chowder? Yep, which promotes a little bit of uh, extra healing. And I got... Some, uh, th we had four... We got quite a few uh, potions and soups and things from... Uh, from doing the... Um, <laughs> What am I trying to say? The uh, Manta race over there, the wave race. So, yeah, we're ready to go. Um, I just need to punch in our teleport command, which I failed to do ahead of time. A uh, couple of these guys are on the stationary bike here. <laughs> it's, uh... Oh, no. Okay. No! Start. Bring up the console. Okay, so we are going to do cheat, and I'll bring you back when this is typed in. So you don't have to watch. Okay, guys, here we go. Uh, hopefully this gets us all in there. Um, so yeah, we have, uh, I took one Rex out, so we're, we have 14 Rexes going in. That one Rex just wasn't healing very fast. So we got 14 Rexes, and we have our um, uh, Uteranus here for the for the damage buff, and that's what we're going with. I brought, um, I made a few more bullets because I know here we can get knocked off a little bit, and uh, I know it's a little bit cold in there. So I brought what fur armor we had, and hopefully between that and the soups, um, we'll actually be able to uh, to not freeze so yeah hopefully we'll uh, we'll get this done um, if you haven't seen our previous episodes all these Rexes are about 50k health and uh, between 2500 and 3k damage they're very well leveled um, and here we go Oh, did this take everybody? Oh, crap. That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, Pardon my French. I'm going to bleep that out. Oh, my God. Everybody's here. Well, this was a mistake then. Holy crap. Who isn't here? Okay, well, this is bad. Well, we'll, we'll figure it out. I don't know how many we can drag in there. Um, who is that over there? Are you even in here, dude? Well, this may have been a mistake. Can I get you out of here? <laughs> I can. Okay, well, this is the one I was trying to leave home. I didn't realize the the Ascension teleporter was uh, was much wider. So it's been yeah, it's probably been a year plus since. Um, all right, I guess I got to put these on. Apparently, we're freezing already. Okay, that helped. Um, so yeah, this Rex is he's the one. He's only got. He doesn't even quite have half health, so I guess, I don't know, man, I guess you're coming with us. I don't know if the rules are different here. I don't know how many of these guys actually. Well, it certainly let me take more. Where did these guys go now? All right, I'm super confused. Oh, they were over here. Okay. All right, well, this place is pretty cool. I've only been here, like I said, once before, maybe an hour and a half. 
uh, a year and a, an hour and a half ago. A year and a half ago. Um, I think, let me get on the Uteranus and I think you can see it better. Or, I guess I can just use you following me still, aren't you? So these rooms, I guess, this overlooks, it looks like the, uh, I think you can see the, the Broodmother image there. So this room overlooks her her boss arena, which uh, we we Earth screwed up in pretty bad. Uh, we got a dino killed in there, and a lot of our other guys were crushed. This is the dragon arena, where uh, we actually did pretty good there, didn't we? We did all right there. And I think, and the mammoth is here. And oh my god, some of these guys should not be here. Well, we may end up losing some dinos here. And yeah, this is the uh, Megapithecus arena. We beat them like right over there. So pretty cool. This is actually, you know, I was here once, like I said before, and this is really pretty much my favorite room. I think on this island. Oh, and even the little dodec is here. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, um, I think there's some sights to see down here, so what I'm going to do is I'll just walk down, kind of show this room off a little bit, and then uh, I have to drag all the all the creatures down there. What is what's blinking? Because I am on this guy. Is there anything on this map, or is it just water? I think it's blinking. So maybe I'll just run so we can see. Oh, this looks like, uh... Really? No. Just... Can you... Can you stop? Um, this looks like DNA strands, maybe? So I think it's just a sh showing all the... Yep, there's a moss chops and we saw a ray there. So that's... All the creatures. Oh, there is a landmass up there, I guess. Not sure what this depicts, if it depicts Earth, or if it depicts the new Earth. Um, I know there are some Explorer notes in here, too. Let's see what's a little further down here. This place is so cool. Well, I'm just going to pick up these Explorer Notes as we go, because, um... Oh, and this looks like human DNA, okay. Looks like the male and female DNA. Pick this up. And I'm not going to read this, but... This is what? This is a Rockwell... Rockwell Explorer note. Okay. Oh, this looks a little more Earth-like. That looks like Africa. Maybe Australia down there on the right. So this looks more... more Earth-like. Yeah, South America, Antarctica. Alright, that's... That's cool. What else we got? Anything? Oh yeah, we got more even. Uh oh. Maybe I wonder if that was like ancient Earth and then current Earth and then this is uh... This is why we're in arcs today. <laughs> Earth. Not good Earth. And these are the humans related to not good Earth. Are these the, uh, the advanced ascended humans? I, I don't know. Why are you thirsty? Oh my god. I don't have any water. You know what? I think one of those guys has some berries. <laughs> um, okay, I'm gonna get, I'll bring you guys back. I'm gonna... I think I missed a couple of Explorer notes back in the beginning, and uh, I will get the dinos assembled and bring you all back.
Okay, guys, we are back. I think we're just about ready. Um, I have just come back from taking a third look to make sure that nobody has been left behind, and they haven't. And uh, I realized we didn't, uh, I didn't show off this room to start with. And it looks like this is where all the supply drops come down. So we got a blue one going down, we got a green one. Yeah, you see it just shot down there. Uh, this is pretty cool, actually. I was nervous I was going to fall through here. But uh, apparently it's solid or, you know, see-through. So that's, I presume, the island. And uh, this, these are all the supply drops being put down. I was, I was kind of wondering, maybe we can talk to somebody and have them actually put some good stuff in there instead of just getting, you know, blueprints for an electrical cable or a compass or something. So it looks like all of the wrecks has made it, including the one that I put off to the side. Um, and then in addition, we got the Barry. I'm trying to count like how many dinos are actually here. So it looks like the Day of Dawn I didn't intend to bring, and one of the Rexes I didn't intend to bring. So I had 15 on the pad, and then we got the Day of Dawn, the Anki, the Dodec, the Barry that I'm on, and the the um, the Mammoth here. So I don't know. I'm going to check these guys and see if I'm just going to add melee damage if they have any health. So... Thankfully, the mammoth here had a bunch of berries on him. Um, as you can see, my water is uh, is crappy low, and I didn't I didn't think to bring a, a thermos or anything. Can't eat arrows, so I've just been chowing on uh, on stacks of berries from him. All right, well here goes nothing, I guess. So um, you're safe coming in here uh on this on this platform but once we go down into the arena then it's going to start so i think i want to find the uteranus and see his furry little legs over here and i think i'm going to ride the uti is what my plan is so if we say everybody follow me Do we have the dodec and I just want to make sure everybody got in this room. Um, so hopefully they all, if I recall, all of these guys will teleport out back to the the entrance at the volcano. So they'll all be out there waiting whenever I come back with cryopods to get them all. But. We also have to remember before this battle starts that... Oh, the Uteranus has levels. A level, okay. Um, I need to dump my... Anything in my inventory that I want to keep, I'm going to have to dump into one of the dinos that survive. Uh, because you, you lose all your stuff uh, if you don't put it on a dino. So you ascend, but you ascend with nothing. All right, here we go. Everybody head over that way. Everybody is aggressive. Attack! Are you guys gonna hang back there? I'm not sure they can get him while the shield is up. But essentially, the overseer takes uh, he takes the form of um, of all the previous bosses.
help out these guys. So these idiots just constantly shooting from above. At some point I'll get off and... Uh, oh man. Oh, where's the idiot going? even know what we're doing. I've lost track of everything. <laughs> okay, he's he's getting damaged. That's positive. Okay. Take out some of you morons. Okay. Oh, what are these things? Pieces of element I accept. Although I think we're gonna get some anyway. What are we doing here, team? I haven't seen any red yet. Where's our boss? Kill! I need the Uteranus to, to boost. I don't know where he is. I got knocked off of him in the confusion. Alright, he's... They're tearing through him even without that. Okay. damage him right there or not. These guys are a pain in the butt. me off. Why? Oh, okay, I was riding on his back the whole time. I was riding on one of their backs the whole time. Alright, well that was a good jump right there. At least most of them are following him. Draw everybody. Guys, get in there. Alright, this is taking a while. Killed the monkey, so he's he's about halfway dead in total.
Uterinus has taken a little bit of a beating. Not bad. Dead. Oh, that's not what I wanted. No. Off. This is crazy. Oh, what he's stunning me. I think it's what's happening. I don't even know how many bullets I have left. I need a Rannis and at least put on auto courage. Just need to find him. Get me up on one of you guys. Oh man, you're attacking the wrong thing. I still get 20. God, everybody's in the way. Why can we not move? Let's go, let's go. Alright, we gotta take this guy down. This is Dragon. Well. Guys. No. Come on. Who'd have thought whistling on this guy would be so goddamn hard? Do it myself. I don't know where all my guys are. They're coming. Ooh, that hurt. Ooh, mammoth went down. from him. This Rex is looking pretty bad. Right, I gotta get off of it because they're targeting me. Ah, I don't have enough bullets to waste. Be 
Oop, you don't have any more bullets. <laughs> Stunned. Alright, this is way too disorganized, guys. We are screwing this up. But, alright, I got on something. I got on an aloe. Second, I did. Right. Just to avoid. Oh, he's so close to dying too. We just got to get him to stop so we can attack him. Where is he? Guys, to the dragon. Ooh, I targeted him. This should do it. Get him, team. Get a shot in there. Oh no, we lost another Rex. Did he not die this time? God. Another weapon. Oh, oh shit. Alright, this is bad. This is bad. Why? All of these guys look really hurt. This isn't good. Right, can we actually... Can you land and transform? this guy. Come on, let's get him. Damn it. Alright, I gotta get off him because those things are targeting me. You are by far the strongest. I don't know if we're gonna do it, guys. We can't seem to get over that last hump. Oh my god, we got him. And I wasn't even watching it. Alright. Transfer everything to you. And gotta come over here. Naked and cold. But this is pretty cool here. It's like the solar system and all the arcs floating around. Uh, I'm gonna disable the HUD. 
We are ascending. This kind of reminds me of uh, of Stargate SG-1 or or maybe uh, 2001 A Space Odyssey. <laughs> Weird. Going through tunnel graphics. Amazing, and we got uh, we got some credits. We have defeated Ark. All right, I'm just going to I'm just going to hit end here. Although it's not it's not letting me. Okay, guys, uh, we are back here. Uh we just f finished the credits and we are uh came awake at our little base here by the red obelisk on the island and the only thing here <laughs> are my flyers. So everything is gone. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fly over there real slow with the RG because, um, I've got a cryopod, all those dinos, and, uh, they're all gonna have meat on them, and I, I, I don't think, I don't think the wyvern will be able to carry all that, so, uh, I am just gonna punch and cry, cry them all to me so that's what 18 19 that should be just enough to grab all of our dinos because I know we lost a few so let's see you've got go with health for you How about that so yeah what did we lose I saw that we lost the mammoth I saw we lost at least three or four rexes maybe more um yeah, I'm not really sure what else uh, died or didn't die. So I'll bring you back when I get over there. We'll take a head count and go from there. Okay, guys, we are back at the volcano here. Um, you can see everybody seems to have teleported out here. Uh, all the survivors, they crab right here by the, by the door to the tech cave. So, um, yeah, I mean, I guess we did sort of cheat and skip the tech cave. But could you imagine doing... Uh, running through the tech cave and then also having to survive the um, you know that overseer battle I mean that's that's ridiculous I don't hate myself so there's an explorer note right here I only found two explorer notes in the in the um, the walkway there up to the boss arena but um, I may have missed some look at this the U Tyrannus Oh yeah. I mean, he's like 80% damaged. No food, we don't need that. So I'm going to go through the process here of just cryopotting all these guys and uh Honestly, I don't, you know, th these guys are going to have to heal a ton. I mean, there's no there's no boss battling with any of these dudes. Check this one out. Yeah. Yeah, he lost 40k health almost. Oh my gosh. That battle was no joke, uh, even with my rates. Um, didn't go real well. I kept losing track of the... You know, I did miss a couple of opportunities there, right? I did have the... Uh, uh, he seems to have survived too, our little pig. Um, but we did have the... You know, I could have turned on passive healing with him before we went into the fight, and I could have... Put on auto courage um, for the UD. So uh, yeah, there's a couple of opportunities missed there. Even my guy with the ascendant saddle lost a ton. So not amazing. Okay, guys. Well, I'm gonna wrap these guys up, and uh, there's really no trophies or anything. Uh, the the Overseer doesn't appear to drop much of anything. Um, 
I can show off the alpha implant. So our implant went from the basic silver one to the uh, to this nice alpha one. So we we now have uh, we can go up to level 120. Plus we have the one level on uh, the chibi, so we can go up to 121. Um, this guy's pretty damaged. How did you get actual meat on you? Like raw meat. I wonder if he ate one of his dead comrades. <laughs> Alright guys, well I think that's it. Um, Earth's going to try to pick up the pieces here. Oh, these guys are all massacred. Look at them all. I mean, if that had gone much longer, then uh, then we'd have been in trouble. Um, so it looks like, what do we got there? One, two, three. Uh, it's hard to tell how many Rexes we have left, but I, I, I bet we lost five or six. But uh, I'll give you one last count. We'll, I'll pick up all these guys. We'll go back to base, and I'll give you one last count. Okay, guys, we are back uh, here at, at base at the Red Obelisk. Um, yeah, so the final tally uh, and lessons learned is kind of what I want to go over here for just a couple of minutes. Uh, hopefully you're still watching. Um, so our final tally was it looks like we lost three Rexes and the Mammoth. So the Rexes... Um, not surprising uh one of them at least uh was you know he was less than half health going in there so uh, i didn't anticipate him uh, teleporting in there so um yeah so we lost uh just well we lost four dinos uh out of uh, it, here's the thing is i i think it let me take in more than 20 so we'll get into the lessons learned phase so i brought 19 crowd pods with me uh, be just because that's how many I had here. Um, and I filled them all up with creatures, and we lost four creatures. So it took every creature I had here, except for the flyers. It wouldn't apparently let the flyers in. So, yeah, lessons learned is that you can bring more than 20 to the Overseer battle. So I didn't know that. Um, so I learned that. Also, um, yeah, uh, I would suggest uh, auto courage. You put on if you bring a Uteranus, I would set him to auto courage, because the overseer definitely knocks you off your mount uh, a bunch of times. Uh, those laser beams—they don't do too much damage to you, but they dismount you and they they shock you, which immobilizes you for you know a handful of seconds. Um, so definitely you know, he was running and attacking with all the other guys. So if he was using auto courage, we probably would have um, beaten this guy a bit faster. Also, the Deodon in there, I did not have it enabled um, for uh, passive healing. So that's another misstep uh, on my part. Um, uh, again, would have made the battle a little bit faster. Um... Yeah, oddly enough, our Anki and our Dodek uh, both survived. They only had about 5k health each, but yeah, they both managed to survive, along with the pig. And the uh, the funny thing is, the pig had, what, he must have had uh, at least three or four um, rows of uh, cooked meat in his inventory. And uh, he, he ate it all. So he was healing himself, it looks like, but he wasn't healing anybody else. So yeah, another lesson learned. Utilize uh, the, these utility dinos um, better than I did. Uh, definitely bring some fur armor. I don't know if you need ascended armor in there or if regular fur armor will be good. But I had two pieces of fur armor. One was ascended. Um, and I wasn't cold in there, but it is definitely cold in that arena. So you need... Um, protection against the cold. Uh, I didn't need any of my soups. I have um, 380 health and uh, I didn't need to utilize any of the soups. So, um, or healing brews or any of that kind of stuff, which actually I should put in the thing here rather than me holding them. So, 
Let me just throw these in there. Yeah, so definitely uh, I was getting a little nervous. It turned out the last uh, the last Rex that I cryoed was the one that I put all of my stuff into. He was the one I was riding at the very end. And I was starting to think, did I did he die or something? You know, but it turned out, of course, you know, as Murphy's Law would have it, the very last Rex is the uh, the one that had all my stuff in it. So we did recover, um, you know, my armor and, and my weapons and stuff. So uh, good there. So definitely dump your items off or they, they will be lost in the boss arena. Um, yeah, and bring more dinos. Uh, I could have prepared a, a bigger pool of dinos. Uh, I don't know if we're going to do this again. I'm not even sure what I'm going to do here. Um, kind of post all these boss fights. We don't appear to have gotten a lot of element. Uh, it looks like what little element... Um, I picked up a couple of pieces of element, but I don't even see it in the inventory. So, um, you know, I picked up a handful of things, but uh, it, whatever that was, it didn't make it, um, it didn't make it here. So, um, yeah, so we won't be doing the overseer battle again, uh, for sure, but we could probably heal these guys up and, and do, um, you know, maybe the Megapithecus was probably the easiest one. So we could maybe do that one a few times to get some more element. Um, I think, yeah, if I did this again, I, 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 I might try Spinos in that particular fight. Because Spinos are a little bit faster. Uh, they do every bit as much damage. But, um, are a little faster. I also happen to have, I, I picked up a good blueprint for um spino saddles so yeah if i decide to do this again in this series i may uh spin up a um an army of 15 or 20 spinos and and maybe try again but i don't know i, I don't i don't think i'm going to have that level of commitment um i kind of am looking forward to starting um genesis part two when that comes out so I'm looking to, you know, I'll, I'll transfer over there with this character. Uh, so we'll start, um, or we could just go in and start fresh with a with another character and then wipe that save out. Maybe we'll do that. We'll just start from scratch and see how it is over there. Then we can eventually uh, move this character over. Um, but yeah, I think after this, I'm just going to dump out all these guys, let them heal up slowly over here. And then I'm going to go have fun in the next episode. I think we're going to go tame uh, a couple of birds. Namely a Pelagornis. I believe on February 11th is when the... It may not happen until late at night. But I believe February 11th is when the fear... Uh, not fear of all, but love evolved event starts. So I want to go tame up a Pelagornis. Um, so we can, uh, we can fish right off the back of him. You know, sitting in uh, ponds and, and oceans and whatever. So, I think that's going to probably be the next episode. Uh, as always, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Um, if you find yourself enjoying what we do, if you feel bad for me because I lost some dinos <laughs> and I totally mismanaged that fight, uh, throw us a like, subscribe, comment. All of these things uh, do really help us out in the end. And as always, uh, thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing everybody in the next one.